Hi everyone, it's Vanka, and today I uh, want to show you um, a mini uh, junk journal that I have been wanting to make for a long time. It was so fun to make this. Um, I think it's uh, the most fun projects uh, I have done, so I am uh, a little bit excited to show you because I think it's uh, very uh, funny uh, put together all this but uh, um, it's made out of uh, coffee sleeves and I followed uh, a tutorial um, on YouTube by uh, Simply Shimmery Scraps uh, so you can check it out if you want to make something like this and um, this time, uh, this is the first uh, I have ever made for myself, so um, um, that's fun too. And I have been wanting to use things that people have uh, sent me. And so this uh, junk journal is uh, put together mostly by things I have received from uh, other youtubers and mostly people on from the junk journal junkies group on facebook so i will tell you a little bit how i have put this together but first uh, i will show you the cover and uh, the spine here i have a bottle cap that i haven't glued on yet i'm not sure if I would just glue it on like this or make a charm, maybe, I don't know. But this is, um, I don't have uh, any bottle caps. I have uh, used one from a soda and uh, I have uh, flattened it uh, with my uh, Big Shot and used some sticker from this bottle cap sticker book. and. Uh, also put some glossy accent on it so uh, I used uh, steampunk uh, uh, paper some scraps I had uh, uh, leftovers from um, creating my first uh, junk journal so uh, these uh, steampunk uh, papers I ordered uh, uh, online and I think uh, it's from hot of the press and uh, I have used a lot of um, uh, things that uh, uh, my swap part partner Robin sent me uh, together with um, vintage inspirational junk journal so uh, I will show you she, she sent this uh, wrapping paper that she had uh, ironed on some freezer paper and I, I have cut out a lot of uh, the stamps she has used so it's uh, it was very fun putting this together and also um, she uh, sent me some other paper and as you see <laughs> there's not much uh, left, I have put, uh, cut out lots of uh, words from uh, this paper, and this is uh, all that's left. So uh, I have uh, cut out words and sort of uh, made up a story uh, through this uh, junk journal. So that was what made it so fun. And um, it's uh, it's made out out of junk. I will say this uh, says uh, uh, Madame Stoltz. That's a brand from uh, for uh, some interior. I don't know where I got it. it uh, maybe I bought some stuff for the house, and I have always taking care of so, uh, little things like this 
and this is uh, a part of a earring and uh, I used uh, this uh, corrugated uh, cardstock or yes this one around and I don't recommend that because I didn't think about it would um, uh, tear when I folded it over the edge here so but I don't mind it's okay and um, uh, so the story begins uh, on the cover and it says daydreaming is starting to get me into trouble and uh, here is a cutout from that uh, sheet Robin sent me notice it says and um, this opens like this and um, also cut out from that sheet uh, and words it says I need to find a way and uh, um, I want to say thank you <laughs> to everyone that has sent things to me that I can use here <clears throat> so I say thank you thank you now and I will mention your names uh, while we go through the book but I can say thank you every time because that uh, would be a lot of thank yous uh, so uh, this uh, tag uh, Lori sent me and these uh, stick pins I got in a happy mail from uh, uh, Michelle a feather from a friend of mine and this is just uh, uh, things that you all often find on um, Christmas uh, that you hang on your Christmas tree um, and just some scraps uh, from a cutout and uh, acetate um, this is uh, from uh, ephemera packs that uh, Car Karen sent me Oops, I love them Tim Holtz ideology ephemera pack just uh, expedition and thrift shop so I have used some of them inside this uh, junk journal very fun and a tiny little tag with a bling that I had in my stash and uh, this uh, car I glued on get a little crazy uh, this and um, this arrow was from uh, Robin as well and uh, uh, this uh, suitcase I cut out of um, uh, it's a nut uh, bag or cup that we when we buy loose weight nuts at the store we, we put them in a, in a bag or cup and that had uh, lots of images uh, on it that was very suited in this journal so I cut them out and it's a little tag on the back side and I cut out here and this tabulator was in, <coughs> in this uh, ephemera pack from Bow Bunny so it says um, it really takes a load of my mind happy you see get traveling and um, departure also from that nut cup and just some scraps you can journal on the back it's a better way so take a trip and here are uh, coffee sleeves that uh, also Michelle sent me and here, uh, this one is uh, also from that uh, nut cap and also this boarding pass and I glued on a little uh, one cent euro and you can uh, journal on the back side this uh, swivels around some steampunk gears yes and where do you think you're going to this is also from the nut bag and uh, tickets from uh, Karen 
And you can journal on the back. And uh, another tag, it says hot sunshine. This paper clip came from Robin and this little tab came from Lutzli. And this uh, ephemera uh, I got from Alicia. It says on the chair, so good, it's only fair. And um, this was also cut out from a sheet uh, that uh, Robin sent me. Mm. And here, this was a necklace of mine. And one day, suddenly, it just broke in two. So I just used, uh, glued it on and uh, colored it. It was this silver color. And uh, this one opens like so. And inside it says uh, reading and learning several, several times daily. And I have uh, just made a mini book from some salt paper. And this uh, washi tape also came from Robin. And here we have some uh, chocolate paper. And yum! Some scraps I had. And here I have made an envelope, pens, and I have a pen, very flat one as you see, so it fits right in there. And this is uh, some all of these stickers and washi tape uh, I have peeled off packages, letters that are sent to me. And these are um, some uh, uh, scrapbook uh, adhesive uh, uh, paper so you can put things on and get them off and these are all just some thin wrapping paper and some die cut and I made a pocket here with a, a tag inside and this tab came from Anne and more chocolate paper delicious it says and here I open the coffee sleeve, sleeve as this. And it says, uh, no more work and watch the clock. Good for you. And uh, also a vellum piece from Karen with a bird here. And I glued it on a tag. And tickets came from Robin. Play and live, it says. like this and here I have tab tag with the um, uh, one more tab from Leslie and this was from a tea tea bag and it says rainforest rainforest alliance certified and I glued on words after a few days it is so tempting to make some business business meetings and uh, stamp uh, Robin had used on the wrapping paper official business so you know uh, sometimes when you go on vacation or have a lot of time off it can get a little boring <laughs> so this also came from uh, Karen and quality not quant quantity good job doing business and uh, a hanger from Tim Holtz and just some ephemeras from um, Karen this like doing much work and purchasers receipt and um, 
uh, I have some scissors that makes this edge and these uh, googles also came from that nut cap and um, here is uh, this is interesting uh, this is one of uh, the pieces something sometimes you get gifts that you are not sure what to do with so this uh, I think my girls got this from some friend of ours who had been in um, Thailand and it's handmade from uh, straws but uh, it was just laying around and what can you <laughs> do with it so I glued it on and it says they get out of control and they had a tub and it says too much for me and uh, I made a a pocket also here and this is a uh, postcard so I think they will be writing home and um, want to go home so it's a, also a stamp from Robin that um, wrapping paper transfer and um, this image was also from that uh, cup of nuts and here we have an um, uh, arrival and this says uh, homebound and that is a clothing tag and this is a vellum envelope and this tag was inside of that and uh, sometimes uh, it's just coincidences that makes things work for you because I was reading what uh, it says in, inside here and um, it fitted very well to this uh, theme uh, of this uh, junk journal so um, I will read some of it a home is a place of residence or refuge homebound is a Scandinavian fashion brand the motivation for creating the brand was to offer the customer a new take on clothing the name homebound comes from Homeward bound, which means to be moving or travel homeward, often used by sailor, sailors on their course home. And the, the logo is an uh, anchor and it symbolizes the port of home. Inspiration comes from the urge to create. And picking the right trims and details is a true passion. <laughs> yes. So I think that uh, fitted very well. And inside here, this is also a, a paper clip from Robin. And um, it's just the journal. And uh, this was also from uh, the Tim Holtz ephemera pack. And uh, inside I have a time card that Irene sent me. And I folded it. And glued it and uh, made a pocket here. Uh, another tab from Anne and uh, just some place from for a journal also and it has uh, the days and this number four that that is because this is uh, the fourth um, junk journal I, ha I have made. So um, that goes in there. And the last page says, I am not an expert, but mixing is an art. Hand smashed for fun and by heart, Manke. 2015. And uh, this is just some twine and uh, this piece here uh, is from a uh, sort of a button closure thing I got from a place I don't, can't remember <laughs> and uh, on the back it, it's just plain and I just glued a little bling on there and uh, it closes uh, like this very easy and it was so so fun 
to make this and I really like how it uh, turned out. I think it's a fun story uh, about daydreaming and following your dreams and w when it comes down to it maybe home and uh, daytime life is the best after all. <laughs> So let me think. Let me know what you think. Uh, and uh, until next time, I hope you are all well. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. Bye bye.